Sukiya has got to be in my top list of my favorite fast food chains. No kidding, I can eat this all week. There's just something about raw egg with rice that I love so much. It just elevates my whole meal. And my favorite thing to get here is the gyudon. I got hungry from walking. So before I go shopping, I love raw egg on rice. Oh my god, it's so good. met up with my mom because she came from work and I came from home and now it's time to go grocery shopping. It's actually the best time to go at night to shop here at night because some of the products go on sale. So you can get like a discount on selected meat products. This is our favorite because we love to eat steak and yakiniku. Mm -hmm. So there's also like discounted cooked food, produce, bread and many more. So if you're on a budget and you don't really want to eat Kombini food, like 7 Eleven food, head to the grocery store because there's so many goodies here. sister just came home from work and she's tired as fuck <laughs> <laughs> she's so tired so she got this malibu rum and mixed it with pineapple juice uh -huh. what's your work again do you want to share i work at an izakaya izakaya what how do you call izakaya in english again um like a resto bar yeah, kinda, yeah. Resto bar and she mixes drinks. So and she, make cocktails. Yeah, she makes cocktails. <laughs> you should teach me like how to make good cocktails. Sure. She got home, brought out the Royce and some Malibu. This is mine. Cheers. <laughs> To the dreamiest place here near Tokyo which is also one of my favorite places to visit here in Japan we're going to Kamakura and it's just so nice there it's so magical there's so many temples so many eating places so many cafes it's a really nice place to go to if you want to unwind if you want to relax you know after a long tiring work week we literally start every adventure going to 7-eleven before we get to our destination we buy coffee or like snacks here
with my sister's outfit. Kawaii. So we're here at Kamakura. I think our first stop will be Komachi Dori. We want to check out this omiyage place. It's a famous like omiyage store here in Kamakura, according to my sister. Look at our outfits though. We're both matchy wearing fur. We're furry today. Yeah, we're pretty furry today because it's cold. Some of their items were already sold out, so we ended up getting this one. It has a variety of the products that they have here. Got the goodies! And now we're gonna go eat. Kind of feel sick, not gonna lie, but we're gonna get through it. This one's so cute too. Yeah, it's cute. Right? I like the red one. Yeah. person in front of us got everything. Everything that my sister wanted. <laughs> Let's get the white chocolate eclair. My go-to activity when I'm here with family is to walk around and eat. We usually share so we can try a lot of things because I don't know about you but I get full quite fast so I usually just get a bite of everything and then I'm good. Also food just tastes way better when it's shared like for some reason it always tastes the best when you're sharing it with someone or when it's like scarce <laughs> or when you don't get too much it just makes it more special for me right now i'm having a slight obsession with matcha like matcha flavored desserts i just can't get enough of matcha lately but specifically matcha ice cream they make it so delicious here i honestly didn't get the hype before especially during the matcha <laughs> Kit Kat era my taste buds Yummy. didn't like yeah. that and I believe it's what turned me off with matcha flavored desserts. But now, after trying matcha ice cream, I get the hype. Like, I could never say no to matcha ice cream. <laughs> si mama <nakikiago>. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I've been looking for Ichigo Daisoku and I found one in this store. We actually went here before also, but we got the candied strawberries. Now, we're gonna try this. <laughs> the matcha is really sweet, but the strawberry is kind of sour. It's a good balance of sour and sweet. This is so cute! Anything pastel, I love. Which color should I get? This one? It would be so cute if this was strawberries. This has got to be my favorite temple in Japan. And I've gone to a lot. If you go to Kamakura, don't skip this temple. I love going here because there's a little bit of everything. Yeah, I so think healthy. we spent about an hour exploring this place. It's called Hasadera Temple. So once you get in, you're welcomed by the serene garden with a koi fish pond. And of course, we had to take a bunch of photos. 
Words can't describe how beautiful this temple is. We also went up this scenic viewpoint where you can get a bird's eye view of the city and the sea. It's a little bit of a hike which honestly helped me burn all of the goodness I ate today because I ate a lot. They even have this little bamboo pathway. The last area we visited in this temple was this mini cave where we had to crouch down to enter. And overall, this was such a wonderful day trip. I always tell my friends to add this to their list when visiting Japan because it's literally an hour away from Tokyo, but the vibes, the vibes are immaculate. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I am so excited to take you along to more adventures this year. I am taking you to different spots of Japan this 2024 and I am so excited because I'm always down for a mini adventure and it's always a good time when I get to take you along.